The Younger Dryas period, the emergence of civilizations, and the riddle of the site of Gobekli Tepe are intriguing aspects of human history. We're going to discuss the Younger Dryas and its potential impact on the timing of civilization emergence. And towards the end of this video, we'll discuss the baffling Gobekli Tepe. By examining these interconnected elements, we'll gain a deeper understanding of the complexities that shaped our past. The Younger Dryas period, which spanned from 12,900 to 11,700 years ago, remains a mystery. This abrupt return to near glacial conditions during a warming trend after the last ice age poses several unanswered questions. The triggering mechanism of the Younger Dryas is a subject of immense debate among scientists. Some theories propose that an influx of melting ice in North America disrupted oceanic circulation, potentially leading to the shutdown of the Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation, or AMOC. Other theories hint at extraterrestrial activity or volcanic activity as potential triggers. Determining the exact cause remains an ongoing challenge that requires further research and investigation. Another confusing aspect of the Younger Dryas is its duration and variability. Traditionally believed to have lasted 1,200 years, recent studies propose that it may have consisted of multiple shorter cooling episodes with intermittent warming periods. Understanding the precise chronology and dynamics of the Younger Dryas is crucial for comprehending the impact of various aspects of Earth's climate system including atmospheric and oceanic circulation patterns, vegetation distribution, and ice sheets. The Younger Dryas is also linked to potential consequences for ancient human civilizations and ecosystems. Some researchers suggest the sudden cooling may have contributed to the extinction of large mammal species, such as mammoths, and affected the lifestyle and migration patterns of early human societies. Trying to figure out the connections between climate change and human responses during this period provides an interesting avenue for further research and exploration. The emergence of civilizations is a multifaceted phenomenon that occurred thousands of years after the Younger Dryas. The apparent gap between the last ice age and the rise of early civilizations around five to 6,000 years ago presents a fascinating puzzle that archeologists and anthropologists are still trying to solve. Various factors contributed to this transition. Environmental changes played a crucial role as the end of the last ice age brought about climate instability and shifts in resource availability. Populations had to adapt to these new ecological conditions, potentially influencing the pace and trajectory of cultural and technological development. Technological progress, especially during the transition from hunting and gathering to agriculture, was another pivotal factor. The development of agriculture allowed for settling farming communities, surplus food production, and the rise of complex social structures. This shift required a combination of technological innovations such as domestication of plants and animals along with knowledge accumulation and social organization. Cultural and cognitive factors also played significant roles in the emergence of civilizations. The accumulation of specialized knowledge, the establishment of social institutions, and the evolution of governance systems are complex processes that must have taken time to develop. These cultural factors, along with the environmental and technological aspects, contributed to the rise of civilizations across different regions of the world. But we have to avoid simplistic narratives that early humans were inherently barbaric or less advanced. Human societies have diverse levels of complexity throughout history, and the concept of progress should be approached with nuance. Furthermore, the lack of evidence for earlier civilizations in certain regions may be attributed to poor preservation or limited archaeological exploration rather than the absence of complex societies. Gobekli Tepe, located in modern-day Turkey, adds another layer to the complexity of human history. This ancient archaeological site dating back to the 10th millennium BCE predates the emergence of known civilizations by thousands of years. Its discovery challenged conventional theories about the timing and development of complex societies. Gobekli Tepe consists of monumental stone pillars, intricately carved with animal reliefs and arranged in circular structures. The complexity and craftsmanship displayed at this site is remarkable suggesting sophisticated cultural and social organization. However, the purpose of Gobekli Tepe and the nature of the society that constructed it remain a mystery. The existence of such an advanced monumental structure at a time when hunter-gatherer societies were presumed to dominate the landscape raises intriguing questions. Did Gobekli Tepe represent a communal gathering place, a ceremonial center, or maybe it's the remnants of an early religious site? But every time we don't have the answer for something, it, it's not a religious site, but I'm just saying. How did the construction and maintenance of this complex monument coincide with the prevailing societal norms of the time? Suggesting that complex social and cultural developments may have occurred earlier than previously believed. Exploring the site and uncovering its mysteries provides valuable insights into the cognitive capabilities, social dynamics, and cultural complexities of early humans. The Younger Dryas, the emergence of civilizations, and the mysterious Gobekli Tepe 
collectively contribute to a better understanding of what shaped our human history. The mystery surrounding the Younger Dryas, its potential impact on ancient societies, and the complex factors that influenced the emergence of civilizations highlight the intricate multifaceted nature of our past. Meanwhile, the mysterious site of Gobekli Tepe challenges traditional narratives pushing back the timeline of sophisticated cultural and social developments. By exploring how these things are connected, we gain insights into what shaped our journey as a species. But much further exploration is going to be needed to shed light on the complexities that shaped our human history.